Today I'm going to be playing through the career of DK Metcalf, but after every season, he's going to be switching to a new team. So as you guys can see, obviously to start off year number one, DK Metcalf is on the Seahawks. And I mean, the offense definitely isn't looking bad. They can definitely make a push for the playoffs, but the O-line is not looking so well. And on the other hand, I mean, there's definitely some spots we could improve on, but the defense is looking pretty stacked. So I mean, if this team plays well, we can definitely have a good season right out of the gate, but I'm going to go ahead and sim to the playoffs and hopefully we can make it as you can see we went 10 and 7 to win the division i mean surprisingly the rest of this division kind of sucked and we got to play the vikings in the wild card round and as you can see we got the win i mean it looks like the vikings kind of just didn't want to be there so now we play the falcons and it looks like we're also going to take down the falcons with a two-point win so now we played the number one seed cowboys for a trip to the super bowl and i mean as you can see we got an interception so we have crazy field position to start this game off i mean this playoff run so far has gone way better than expected but i mean at the same time if any of you play franchise you already know the cowboys do not mess around on madden they might be like the hardest team to beat right now we almost squeezed in three yards to go i mean as long as fant or probably smith and jigba gets open this should be a touchdown he's probably gonna be the best bet here and he's wide open so that's gonna be a touchdown from smith and jigba which is gonna give us the lead first here but i mean you guys know the drill it's time to sim to the end of this game and as i said the Cowboys are no joke man so this could go either way as you can see in the fourth quarter though I mean surprisingly enough the Cowboys are actually getting killed right now they've only got eight points and if we score here that's probably gonna put the game away so as unexpected as it is the seahawks are going to the super bowl in year number one i mean metcalf didn't have his best season ever but it definitely wasn't bad 775 yards for seven touchdowns i mean in the process my boy went all the way up to a 93 overall but anyways i mean it doesn't look like things are going to be getting any easier for us because we have to take on patrick mahomes and the chiefs in the super bowl and it looks like mahomes also won mvp this season so i mean apparently He's been balling, just like always. We do start with the ball here, though, so I gotta make sure we score on this drive, because, I mean, we already know this. Mahomes is gonna be going off today. Oh, come on, Walker. That's gonna be short of the first down, but it's still a good pickup. Second and three, though, I mean, as risky as this play is gonna be, I'm gonna try and go for a shot with Metcalf, and oh my god, he's actually wide open. That is a massive pickup. That might be a touchdown. It looks like we're not getting caught here, so two plays into the the super bowl and metcalf is already in the end zone so that's gonna give us the lead first here i mean that play was amazing i really didn't think that would work but we're gonna sim to the end of this game i mean we already know how mahomes works so this is gonna be a tough one to win and i mean as you can see in the fourth quarter the rest of the game did not go as planned we're getting absolutely cooked right now so we're gonna make it all the way to the super bowl just to get dogged by patrick mahomes i mean all honesty when i seen we were taking on the Chiefs this is kind of what I expected to happen I mean I didn't even expect to make it to the Super Bowl so I'm just happy that we got this far but either way year number one is going to end in disappointment because as you can see Patty Mahomes is going to be hoisting the Lombardi trophy this year but anyways that's going to bring us to year number two and as you can see it looks like Metcalf went to the Chicago Bears and I mean all honesty the offense is pretty similar to Seattle's on the other hand I mean the defense is definitely looking pretty solid but they're no near what seattle has but once again we're gonna go ahead and sim to the playoffs and hopefully the bears can surprise us but i mean i i just can't see the bears making the playoffs i mean surprisingly enough the bears went off this season going 13 and 4 to win the division we gotta take on the packers in the wild card round and it looks like we're gonna sneak away at the dubs so now we play the cowboys in the divisional round but unfortunately this time dallas is gonna be too much to handle i mean we got absolutely shit on that is kind of embarrassing to be honest with you i don't know how the hell you come back from getting beat 34 to nothing by the cowboys so i mean i think metcalf is actually going to be happy that he's going to a new team next year as you can see though i mean he had another decent season 833 yards for only four touchdowns though so i mean it's nothing special but it's not terrible and it looks like this time joe burrow is going to be winning mvp this season but once again it looks like the cowboys got another shutout win for the super bowl this time i mean to be honest 
honest with you i'm just happy that we weren't the only ones but anyways that's gonna bring us to year number three and as you can see metcalf went to the patriots and i mean all honesty this team definitely isn't looking terrible i mean the defense could definitely use some work but this isn't the worst defense in the league i mean once again we're gonna go ahead and sim to the playoffs i'd like to think that we can make it but to be honest with you i don't have a whole lot of hope for the patriots just because of how stacked that division is i mean surprisingly enough though it looks like the pats are back on top because we went 12 and 5 to win the division i mean the rest of the division absolutely suck though i don't understand how everyone else went 5 and 12 we gotta take on joe burrow and the Bengals in the wild card round and surprisingly enough it looks like we're gonna take down the Bengals. so now we play the chiefs in the divisional round and this one i really don't understand but somehow we took down mahomes and the chiefs so now we play the ravens for a trip to the super bowl as you can see we're in the third quarter i mean we have not had the best start to this game the ravens are kind of dogging us right now i mean i was hoping we could have a really good revenge tour here but i mean it looks like we're gonna need a miracle for that to happen i mean we already took down burrow and mahomes which is pretty good either way but i mean we need uh, if we can get a touchdown here we have a chance but i mean the chance of that actually happening is very slim just because it seems like nothing is really going our way right now i mean they brought up a third and ten so i'm kind of betting all my money on metcalf here he is wide open though for a massive first down so that keeps the drive alive i'm gonna go for a run here though i mean i don't want to risk throwing an interception or anything in the red zone oh that's a good pickup 11 yards to go i'm going back to that play of metcalf though because i mean i feel like it really hasn't failed me yet and if it can work again i mean i'm hoping this can be a touchdown it's not gonna be but that's still a good pickup i'm gonna go the other way with juju this time i mean they brought up another third down so we are in serious danger of getting held to a field goal here juju's gonna save the day though so we're in for the touchdown but i mean that might be coming way too late in the game we're still gonna be down by 10 points so i mean again we're gonna need a miracle if we want to win this but i do have hope and as as you can see in the fourth quarter i mean we have the ball and we're gonna score to take the lead so i mean if we can get a stop here we might actually win this game but it looks like that's not gonna happen and we're gonna give the ball up in the red zone when we had a chance to take the lead back which really sucks because that means we are going home but i mean again we had a better run than i expected i mean yardage wise metcalf went off this year with 1059 yards but at the same time he only had two touchdowns but it looks like like Lamar is gonna win MVP this season which makes me feel a little bit better about the fact that we lost to them but it looks like the Ravens are gonna be another team to fall victim to the Cowboys I mean I told you the Cowboys are not playing around on this Madden like they're actually insane anyways that brings us to year number four and it looks like my boy Metcalf is sick of getting beat out of the playoffs because he went to the Kansas City Chiefs and I'd say this is by far his best chance at winning the Super Bowl I mean we got Patrick Mahomes that's all you really need the defense defense isn't the best in the league but at the same time they're definitely good enough to push us to the playoffs but i mean i guess there's only one way to find out so once again we're gonna go ahead and sim to the playoffs and i mean the fact that we're working with patrick mahomes now it should be no question that we make it and as expected i mean the chiefs went off this season going 16 and 1 to win the division which is also gonna give them the number one seed in the playoffs and as you can see i mean 997 yards for six touchdowns it's not terrible but I thought we would have done a lot better since we're working with Mahomes now. But anyways, it looks like we got to take on the Colts in the divisional round. And it looks like we're going to escape with the win. So now we play the Bills for a trip to the Super Bowl. I mean, as far as playoff games go, I feel like Bills versus Chiefs is probably the best it can possibly get. That's going to be a first down from Pacheco. Apparently, we are one yard short. But either way, that is a ridiculous run to start the game off. On the downside, though, as you guys have probably already realized, Kelsey has retired, so he is no longer on the Chiefs. But I'm kind of hoping that Metcalf can fill the void here. I mean, we also have Rice, who's like a 93 overall now. And he's also wide open for another first down. And we're going to stay up all the way to the 15. After that, though, I'm going to run this play of Metcalf. This is the same one I've been using all day. I mean, it seems like it really never fails me. This play's kind of broken. And it looks like it's going to lead to a touchdown. So we're going to take the lead first here with a touchdown from Metcalf. But you guys know what time it is. We're going to sim to the end of this game. And hopefully we can make another run at the Lombardi Trophy this year. And as you 
you can see in the fourth quarter, we're up by seven points and the Bills are going to tie it. This is exactly what I expected, man. I mean, Bills and Chiefs always come down to the wire. We're in overtime now and it looks like we're going to score, which is going to send the Chiefs to the Super Bowl in year number four. That was one hell of a game though, man. I mean, Josh Allen balled out. That game was super tight as I expected, but as per usual, it looks like Mahomes is going to be getting the best of him in the playoffs. Anyways, it looks like Mahomes is going to win another MVP this season. And unfortunately, we got to take on the Cowboys in the Super Bowl. I mean, I'm pretty sure they've won back-to-back -back Super Bowls now. And this is like the third time they've made it. We're going to need to have one hell of a game if we want to win this. So, I mean, I got to make sure that we score on the first drive here. Uh, we got to go on the run. Come on, Mahomes. That looks like it's going to give us a first down. We've all seen what the Cowboys have been doing so far, though. I mean, they've made it to the Super Bowl like three times in a row now. And they've all also won the Super Bowl twice so hopefully we can break that streak we couldn't get a first there though so I mean that brings up a third down we only need two yards though so hopefully we can pick that up with Pacheco we're barely gonna get in I mean the run game is working all right I don't want to throw an interception or anything so I'm probably just gonna keep running it until I have to throw it that is another first down from Pacheco so far Pacheco is going off this drive I'm gonna switch it up though and try and hit Metcalf here and it looks like that is actually gonna work out for a touchdown that play is actually broken man so that's gonna give us the lead for now at least i mean we're playing the cowboys so i honestly don't have a whole lot of hope in us winning this game but hopefully madden can surprise me as you can see we have a one score game in the fourth quarter but the cowboys are gonna score again so we're down by 10 and that clock is getting dangerously low so as expected i think this is the third season in a row that the cowboys have won the super bowl which is actually brutal i mean at this point you you just can't beat this team if patrick mahomes Holmes can't do it I think it's safe to say that nobody can but as you can see to end off year number four once again the Cowboys are going to be hoisting the Lombardi trophy but anyways that's going to bring us to year number five which is going to be the final season of this video and as you can see Metcalf is on the Bengals now and I mean this team is probably the best team that he's been on so far I mean the offense is stacked and I mean as you can see it's the same story with the defense and considering we have not won a Super Bowl yet I mean I'd say this is probably our best chance at doing that but for the final time we're gonna go ahead and sim to the playoffs and hopefully we can actually win a Lombardi trophy this season. But somehow, we managed to only go 10-7 and seven to finish third place in the division. I mean, on the bright side, at least we made the playoffs. We played the Chiefs in the wildcard round, but I mean, when you have an 89 overall offense, I expect more than 10 wins out of you. I mean, on the bright side, it looks like we're gonna take down the Chiefs. So now we play the Steelers in the divisional round. But unfortunately, that's as far as we're gonna make it because we got absolutely smoked. I don't understand understand how we beat Patrick Mahomes but end up losing to the Steelers anyways Metcalf had 1053 yards for eight touchdowns I'm pretty sure that is the best season he's had all video and it looks like the Steelers ended up making it all the way to the Super Bowl just to get demolished by the Eagles but anyways that's gonna do it for this one I mean kind of a disappointing end but I mean we did have some good runs we made it to the Super Bowl twice but still couldn't win it but anyways if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and subscribe it really helped out the channel and if you have any video ideas feel free to drop them down in the comment section below and while you're down there you might as well comment the most random thing you can think of so we can confuse everybody in the comment section but other than that i'll see you guys in the next one peace out